Hello everyone. Uh, today we are going to learn about how to draw a, a spiral staircase in a residential building. So let's start. At first, let us draw a circle. So I take a circle of five feet. You can simply take it. Take the diameter of circle as per the width of the tread needed. So for an for my case, I am taking five feet. Our circle of five feet diameter has been drawn. So again, let us draw another circle of six inches. So our two circles has been drawn. Uh, uh, let me divide the outer circle into eighteen different parts. For that, type div, select the object to divide, and into eighteen different parts. Enter. Now let us draw a line along the divided points. So now after drawing these lines, let us delete the unnecessary lines. So let us trim this and from here okay. let us delete these lines also because uh, and then let me draw an arc. Now, from this way we move upwards as I have shown by this line. So, after drawing a plan, let us go towards the elevation of drawing our spiral staircase. So, for that, we need to draw a construction line XL enter P enter in the small circle and also here. So, let us draw a horizontal line. This is our plinth level and uh, in simple residential building we keep our riser height from 5 inch to 6 inch so let us take 6 inch riser height so offset 6 inch let us extend this line okay. trim the unnecessary lines as you can see so. my first staircase look like this now again draw a construction line 
in this this and this now we can copy in this portion let us offset 6 inch to this line now we can copy the whole thing from this portion and then put it there now we can simply copy in this portion and then copy it from this point and then keep on pasting it okay now let us trim unnecessary parts and this is not necessary and this jerkies and this this and this Now let us delete the unnecessary portions. Now again, let us draw a construction line towards the next side. you can simply draw a construction line horizontal construction line and place it here and then offset it 6 inch again offset the thickness of We just trim the unnecessary parts. Now our first steps has been completed on this side again. Let us offset six inches. Now we can copy these things. Now let us extend and this also let us extend it to the hole. Now and copy these portions from this point. Okay, now let us trim the unnecessary parts.
in construction line this portion trim trim all the unnecessary lines as it will create confusion so Our spiral staircase has been drawn as you can see. Our elevation has also been drawn. And this is the top level. The distance between the top level of this and this is 9 feet 5 inch generally in our context. So it should be 9 feet 5 inch. Now our elevation of spiral staircase has also been completed. So let us draw a handrail. Handrail is generally kept uh, about uh, 36 to 34 to 40 inch. So, and uh, about one and a half inch from this portion. So, let us draw a circle of half inch. And our handrail of 34 inch now delete this offset uh, the diameter of handle pipe <coughs> vary in various sizes so in my case I am taking half inch so offset or let me take one inch now we can simply copy this and then paste Copy Upset One point five inch Now delete this line now simply copy and then paste now you can simply use this spline to draw and Now we can offset this two inch to the inner side, extend this to here and 
stream the inner portion lines. Generally, the this upper railing is kept of two inch square pipe. Okay, after trimming this portion, we can simply get our desired spiral staircase. Well, our spiral circus looks like this. Thanks for watching, and hope you will also practice this once and then make it use in your daily life. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe this channel and share with all your friends.